till now we got many voltages many signals right so here in any schematic there will be a power sequence almost 99% schematics you can see the power sequence see according to the power sequence we got rdc rdc rst 19 vb 35 ldo ec on 5 volts 3 volts always 3 volts always dsw pm bat low pch power enable till here we got the signal main main signal after getting these signals we got the voltages 3 volts prime 1.8 volt prime so one related all primes so finally the sus acknowledgement okay we once we get these kind of voltages see in between one more signal is there that is uh, ext power gate ash this one is only pch will release that's it it will enable when 1.8 volts prime will enable okay so after that one 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 all one but here prime core won't be there okay after that io will send a acknowledgement signal the requesting of suspend voltage to pch okay according to this it will check once and according to this the pch will release swarn sus warn signal okay after sus warn immediately the pch will release pm slp s5 s4 and uh, s4 only these two they it will release so according to this so as per this the io at a time it will release sys on output okay what we got now now we got s5 ash s4 ash and from io we got sys on okay these all signals what are the voltage it will enable and what are the signals that particular voltage related signals we will get so that we will check in this particular chapter okay till now remember till now we didn't get the ram voltage once we get the ram voltage then only suspend related volts i mean suspend related voltage signals will work see the pm slp s5 ash this is releasing, releasing from where it's sph pch okay the pch releasing this pm slp s5 where it will go that we will check see it's going to io other than the io it's not going anywhere next pm slp s4 ash see here SLP is for RC144. It's act as given, but sometimes this won't work. We can use this signal also. Okay, see, this sun we will check later. Now SLP is for it will go to on. See, you see five. Okay, once we get the SP and SLP is three, then we will get what voltage? The output of this we out. See, this voltage we will get. Hmm? see it has gone to io also io pin number 123 and here a logic circuit it's happening see but here hat has given but no issues you have to know the logic once pm slp s4 ash has come this mosfet will on once it on the voltages in pin 3 so that will go to pin 4 okay so then there will be no voltages here so it means this mosfet will be in off condition in that case sys on will be active see one more places sys on and pm slp s4 both are uh, relatively it's moving see it's enable of 2.5 volts this is the enable for 2.5 volts now the sys on io will release here is the sys on directly going to pin number 8 of the ram ic okay this is the ram ic so here is the enable first enable s5 okay s5 ddr3 hmm? sorry ddr4 this one so here is the first enable and here one more enable has come just now we saw uh, through that s4 and uh, sys1 this power pg power good has come right so that one has given to this one see s5 2.5 volts so now the sys is very very important signal because it will generate once this uh, signal will come so immediately it will generate 1.2 volts vp here okay so uh 
after this where it will go see this one we saw right so s4 ash also came and here session also now came so after this enable this pg and 2.5 volts will generate hmm? see now it's a very 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 important so once we get this 1.2 volts the signal io will release is on the pch will release s5 and s4 right so after releasing these two we cut 1.2 volts vddq hmm? next once we get this suspi voltages from where it will come so it will come from the io when the pch will release this s3 at a time this one io will release this sp ash after this what are the voltage will come this is the turning point the main point for s0 stage so from here it will start before this we will confirm what are the voltage and signals will follow this particular voltages see here this is the vcc voltages for this uc7 so here is the output sm pg control but this is not output final output because this also we have to get but till now we didn't get this one so we are checking only the 1.2 volts see here is a logic here is a pnp transistor so once this uh, transistor will get the voltage to the base then where see collector to emitter this particular ddr pg control will become as sm pg control sm system management so it will go to where so it will go to pm section i mean it's a pc section see the 1.2 volts vddq is going to cpu power so it's very important voltages one of the very important voltage see here the dim slot what is that it's a memory slot dim 1b see these are the pin having 1.2 volts it has 1.2 volts so like that here also see the event something is there right so dim event ash this one is dim 1a this is a memory slot see here uh, what it's generating here is the voltage divider equally it's dividing right so equal in the sense r1 and r2 both value should be equal then only exact half voltages voltage we will get in this point so now we are giving 1.2 volts vddq and here to here it's equal register are there so that's why we will get 0.6 volts here right see this one become as ddrb we reference a it has come to where dim 2b also this is the second slot same thing like uh, dim 1 see here also same thing it's an event that's it 1.2 we got sysan we got here s5 s4 also we got now the term is what susp ash and slp s3 now we will check slp s3 what it will generate see it's releasing from sock okay pch here is the test pad test pad see here we got 1 prime 5 prime sysan s4 this one next we'll discuss now we got this one this one also we got but next uh, we will start this one okay now it says 3 ash okay once we get this susp or we already got this one so then this particular even prime also we got this voltage we will get what voltage here is the 1.0 vscc io or 1.0 vcc stu and other output is 1.8 vs see now it started so it started vs first voltage will start at 1.8 vs see it's going to io also see pin number six that's it so now we'll discuss about susp hash so important signal so we'll check see here susp we got five volts always 1.0 prime and susp susp and this one also ec ix en 
this one it's it has given but anyway it's already generated i think so so once this will come then what voltage we will get we got vcc io 1.0 vsc that vs related all we are getting now hmm? see here suspi came hmm? slps 3 over 4 sison everything we got so now what voltage we are getting we are getting 1.8 vs and this one vcc stu and cc vcc io here you can see the pin number 116 as released suspi ash see here so 5 volts always 3 volts always 5 volts always everything we got right so now suspi also came one suspi came what voltage we will get 3 vs see 1.8 vs we got now it's a 3 vs and 5 vs we got so when we get the suspi ash signal from the io we will get vs related voltages it's a most 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 important uh voltages okay so don't forget it suspi ash is most important one so because uh, it will uh, transfer s3 stage to s0 stage okay those voltages it will generate see here one more voltages one more enable to the uh, ram ic this is s3 s3 what we got suspi ash okay suspi ash once suspi ash comes we will get other voltage what is that reference voltage we will get it's 0.6 vsp this is vtt voltages okay now what we got we got this 0.6 vsp 3 vs 5 vs 1.8 vs okay that's it see from year to year we got almost all voltages anything we skipped no see once again i'll tell you rtc vcc v in bat bat plus vl it's a 5 vl 3 vl 5 volts always 3 volts always ec pch it's a prime actually 1.2 just now we saw 5 volts vs 3 volts vs 1.5 uh, we need to check this one so 1.05 volts vs also we we'll need to check so from this we will get this th this things i think so anyway we'll check once again so this almost till here we got only the remaining thing is this one so later we will check this one okay so now you come to know what are the stages what are the voltages what are the signals you will get depends on the each each stages from s5 to s0 right now the s0 started so in next video complete section of this s0 vs what is that 3 volts vs 5 volts vs 1.8 vs we will discuss thoroughly okay till this step multiple voltages generated so now we will discuss about this suspi generated voltages not now it's next time hmm? so guys this is the complete course we can't tell in one video so that's the reason pin to pin i am uh, explaining you people if you can understand then it's okay if you can't understand so put in comment so those things again i'll uh, repeat to you so i will send you personally in case of you are sending to the uh, telegram in what portion you don't have, uh, don't understand so those things i will explain once again so that's it if anybody wants to join our plc please you are always welcome my number always as given in description and in the video also you can call me for offline and off online uh, course regarding that course okay thank you thank you very much